Hey everyone, Ben here. I hope you enjoy today's video. If you do enjoy today's video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button because we're trying to grow on the platform and turn on the notification bell to be notified of all uploads and live streams. And if you did like today's video, then don't forget to hit a like down below because it helps other people to find our videos. And don't forget to comment down below on any suggestions for content that you have or comment about today's content. Let me know what you thought. Let's get into the video. All right, so for the next episode of Glitch Paradise, we're going back to Oblivion. And in this episode, I'm going to teach you how you can cheese the arena using glitches in order to beat it very quickly and very easily. There's no pressure on this at all. So don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, turn on notifications, and join me on my socials. Those are all linked down below. You know, all that good stuff. So in this, there are a couple of prerequisites. You're first going to want a good amount of skooma. So in this case, use item duplication, which is also a part of a video I did, a part of the Glitch Paradise playlist. And you want to get a bunch of skooma. Now, you're going to want to equip it to your hotbar. So, on console, at least on Xbox, you hold Y and then use the D-pad to put it on one of the D-pad locations. Uh, on PlayStation 3, it works the same way, except, except obviously there's no Y button. You use the triangle button and use D-pad. And then on PC, you want to use the mouse scroll wheel along with numbers 1 through 9 in order to put it on your hotbar. Now, we're going to do a, another glitch called skooma stacking. Basically, skooma stacking allows you to stack eight skoomas as opposed to the normal four, meaning you get twice as much speed from skooma, and this is very easy to perform. You can do this with any potion as well. You can stack eight of any potion. So what you want to do is you want to use the hot bar to drink four. So one, two, three, four. And then in your menu, you want to drink four more. That gives you a stack of eight used. So now we're going to get a bunch of speed. So now... Uh, we'll quickly pause now what we're going to do is we're going to get against a wall and we're going to run at a slight angle towards the wall if with any luck we'll clip through the second you clip through you want to pull backwards and with any luck you'll spawn in that arena ahead and you can actually run up to the gate and use magic or arrows in order to actually take out your opponent before the, the match even starts so we're just trying to get an angle here there we go Go towards the arena. There we go. We're in. So literally, you want to go to this small gap. Aim towards your opponent. Oh, no. A little bit higher. Boom. <laughs> and that allows you to basically cheese any opponent in the arena. It's a really good way of doing it. And it's just super chill. Like, don't get me wrong. There will be times where you will probably mess this up. Uh, so don't be alarmed. It will take a bit of practice. But I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. All the good stuff. Turn on notifications. And join me on my socials. Those are all down below. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.